Hey, what's up guys? We're back with another Hypixel UHC. All right, so I'm just gonna get straight into what we're doing in this game. So I'm gonna be doing the strat that I wanted to do in my last video, but I ended up finding a good book, so I decided to do that instead. Which of course would be the Infinite Speed 2 strat. So as you can see from my hotbar, I went Archer Kit today because I need the feathers to craft two extra ultimates. The first one being Andro, which is just the Sharpness 2 Iron Sword, which when you hold it, you get Speed 1 Resistance 1. Pretty easy craft. All you need is a Blaze Rod, two Iron Blocks, and six feathers. And the next craft is Hermes Boots, which I need for this strat to work. Hermes Boots is just a pair of Pro 2 Diamond Boots. And when you wear them, you get 10% extra walk speed. Basically makes it so when you don't have speed, it gives you speed 1. When you have speed 1, it gives you almost speed 2. And so on. And it's a little bit harder of a craft. You need Diamond Boots, 2 Diamonds, 2 Blaze Powder, 2 Feathers, and a Player Head to craft it. When you combine these two crafts together and you hold Andro, you basically have speed 2 infinitely. Having speed 2 infinitely in high pixel UHC is just a lot of fun because players like to run and they really can't run from you if you have infinite speed 2. So it's probably my favorite strategy and I really wanted to do it today. But I go archer kit so that I have all the feathers I need. I don't have to go around looking for chickens and I can basically go down to a cave instantly. And uh, I'm going to try and find six diamonds down here. So that I can craft my Hermes boots. This looks like a pretty good cave that I spawned like basically right on top of. But the quicker you get all this stuff, the better. So I'm just going to try and get down here and try and get all my stuff. I like to get in and out of the nether really quickly because I often get portal trapped. People like to just sit at a portal for like, you know, a long time and wait for somebody to come through and trap them. So I like to get all my stuff really quick for the strategy and get to the surface as fast as I can with the stuff I need. If I don't end up finding six diamonds down here, should be fine. I can still just go to the surface and see if I can kill somebody for diamond boots. But the whole point of this strategy is to just be fast. Be fast getting your stuff and then be fast with the stuff that you have. Also, I wasn't actually planning on recording today. Um, I was going to upload a stream highlights today. I had this game on stream the other day where I found a triple monster spawner. I ended up winning the game too. It was like triple monster spawner was like one of the rarest things I think I've ever found in this game. And it was overall a really good game I wanted to upload, but... Half my VOD was muted because I play copyrighted music during the stream, so I was kind of sad about that. Ooh, protection 2 gold helmet. That's actually pretty good. I'm going to wear that. In the future, I'll try and download my VODs quicker so they don't get muted or I'll just record while streaming. But I saw a lot of people were excited about stream highlights and stuff, so I will definitely get some of those out soon. And also, if you guys aren't following my Twitch, you guys should definitely do that. I know I would, and I'm pretty sure the community that we have on twitch would love to see some new people around there so if you don't have a twitch account you should just make one drop a follow just say hi in chat we'd love to see you um i'll put my twitch link in the description so make sure to go check that out Ooh, okay i found diamonds this is really good this lapis right here i'm still three lapis short from being able to fortune four though i'm gonna see if i can look around and find three more lapis and then i can fortune those diamonds hopefully that's six and i can go to the nether like instantly and be on the surface like at pvp that would be really ideal for me I do have 29 gold already. Oh, we got more diamonds over here, too. This is perfect. Okay, I'm thinking we should definitely have enough to make Hermes boots, but I'm not sure yet. I haven't seen six diamonds, but these veins look like they'll be good enough for that. All right. Oh, I have 36 gold. That's really good. I'm going to have a lot of healing, which is nice. This looks like a pretty decent diamond vein, too. We didn't get any extra diamonds from the fortune there, but should still be fine. I still got eight diamonds from this, I think. That's not bad. I'm just going to head back to those other diamonds that I found, and then I can go to the nether, and then we can go to the surface. Then we just had to get one kill, and then we're good to go with infinite speed 2 for the rest of the game. Oh yeah, here they are. This is perfect. Alright, this looks like a decent vein of diamonds as well. Okay, I've got 12, so I can make Hermes boots, a Tarn helm, and a sword if I wanted. Okay, let's make our diamond boots. I'm also going to make my Tarn helm. I think I will make a diamond sword just because I'm going to the nether, and there might be people in there. I don't really think that'll hurt. Um, let's also make the rest of my armor. All right, and I can make my portal and let's just, uh, just gotta hope that there's nobody in there waiting for me. Okay, right, now this is a really good spawn. Somebody else already has been in here, so I'm a little bit worried about the other side being trapped. I'm really hoping I can find some blazes soon. I don't want to waste too much time in here. I want to try and get to zero zero when there's still a lot of full irons around, but I don't think that's gonna happen if I don't find blazes soon. Here we go, I found a blaze over here. I also got a magma cream, which is kind of nice. If I kill somebody with a diamond chest plate later, I can, uh, I can make a prop 4, so that could be pretty useful. So there's one blaze rod down. Not bad at all. Just gotta go find one more. Okay, a bunch of blazes just spawned right in front of me. I should be able to fish them over here towards me, though. Alright, here we go. I only need two blaze rods. I was gonna get an extra for a dragon sword as well, but I don't think it's worth it. I just wanted to get back to the overworld now. I want to make sure this portal is not trapped. That's what's uh, been having me worried in here, honestly. Okay, now it took me back to their portal. It took me very close to zero, zero, which is nice. 
Whoever found this cave definitely got a lot of gold out of it. Okay, here we go. I can make my Andrew. Not bad. I'm also gonna make myself a bow because I might need to bow spam some people too. And I also have 45 gold. That's actually insane. Okay. All right, here we go. I can make six gaps here. That's actually so good. Okay, I do see a guy over here with a diamond chest plate. I think he's chasing after somebody. I would kind of like to kill him because I want the diamond chest plate, but he also looks kind of stacked. He's also killing somebody that uh, is trying to bow him in the water. So I'm going to try and help the guy in the water and bow the, the half diamond guy. Okay, this guy's on six, though. I'm going to kill him. Don't mind if I do. He had two heads on him. Let's see if I can get these heads. Of course I wouldn't grab them. I grabbed like everything else though. I can honestly tank a decent amount of damage on the water because I have six gaps. I really need these heads. I got one. I got the other. Perfect. I'm gonna get away from this guy and uh, go make my Hermes boots if I can. Yeah, I don't think he wants me to do that. I'm just gonna bow spam him though, so he's not gonna have a fun time. Yeah, he had a G head on me. He really wants to kill me. Really wasn't that great of a choice. Well, there's some people over there I'd like to kill too. I just want to make my Hermes boots, honestly. He needs to realize that I'm not the person he wants to fight right now. I'm just going to play really annoying until I can make my Hermes boots, so... I don't know what this Flaren's going after me. It's honestly not his smartest choice. You're just going to get backstabbed by the guy behind you, bro. But they're both going for me. What is this? The Flaren, I don't think he really knows what he's doing. I'm just going to try and help him here. Yeah, the Flaren's pretty much dead here. Yeah, he got the head and everything, but I got a lot of free hits on him there, too. This is such a weird fight. I don't know. This guy honestly would have been a lot smarter to go after those two guys I saw fighting earlier with the chest plate and the half diamond. Fighting me is just not the smart choice right now. Because like I said, I just really want to make my Hermes boots. I'm going to play really annoying until I can. I still have two heads on my inventory. I think I can maybe make one into a G head as well, so... Okay, he's on 17. He's blocking up now. I think he's gonna... Yeah, he's crafting something. If I throw out my boots here, I should be able to make Hermes boots, I think. Okay, there we go. Not bad. I got hit once, though, which is a lot of damage. He's on 13. I think he crafted another G head, honestly. I think I just broke his iron helmet, actually. Okay, he's trying to run away now. I did break his iron helmet. That's pretty funny. He's healed that much of this game that his iron helmet has broke. I'm catching up to him so fast, dude. I love these boots so much. Okay, he's on 14. Yeah, I think he ate a G head. I should be able to shred through him, though, because he doesn't have a helmet. He's on two already. There we go. Not bad. I will take that. Thank you very much. Okay, um, so he had two sharp three, so I can make sharp four. That's nice. If I throw out my chest plate, I should be able to make dragon armor. There we go. I got a piece of prop four. I only have two kills now this late into the game though. That fight was like, that was like a final fight kind of fight. It took so long. All right, right before I killed him, I saw somebody underground. I'm gonna see if they're still over there. Yeah, here they are. Yeah, they're still underground and there's another guy here too. If I can kill both these guys. I think they might actually be teaming or something cause like they were right beside each other, but okay. That's fine with me. I'm glad you take both of those kills. <laughs> that was kind of weird. I'm not sure if there's anybody else stacked in this game. I haven't seen a whole lot of people get a lot of kills, so... Actually, this guy who just got a kill, I'm pretty sure he's gotten a decent amount, now that I think about it. I'm gonna go towards him and see what he has. Yeah, I see him over here. He's got a dragon sword, but I think he's only half diamond. No, he's he actually got three quarters diamond. I'm just gonna bow him off this loot. There might be some good stuff still here. No, I think he went through all of it. This guy's definitely killable, though. He's on 19. Oh, he's digging down, though. He doesn't really want to fight me, I guess. I don't like digging down after people that have good stuff. He probably has a couple G heads. I only have one, so I'd probably die down there. Okay, I guess I'll just loop back to zero zero. I still see the uh, the stackful diamond guy there, so. He also did not get lucky and find anybody else, so that's good. Let's see if I can get some bow shots on him while uh, we wait for deathmatch to actually happen. Don't mind dry draining this guy a little bit more. I'm getting a bunch of free hits on him and he hasn't hit me yet, so. That's exactly what I wanted to have happen. He's on five. He's probably gonna have to eat a G head before deathmatch. He's on two. Yeah, he had to eat a G head before DM, so. Definitely did my job there. That was a perfect drain. Exactly what I wanted to do. I only got hit twice, so. And I can make one G head now. So I got two G heads and a regular head. I'm gonna eat a regular head and go around 
the edge of the map and see if I can get some kills like this guy. Because I can make fusion armor if I kill this guy with the chest blade, so... I also would not mind both of these heads, so... I'm gonna just clean this up real quick. Sorry, Southboard, it had to happen. Sorry, Savage Jeff, it had to happen. Yeah, those were two really good kills. I can make two more G-heads. There's another guy coming for me. He just... He's very brave. It's a very brave full iron. Okay. This is going really well for me. This deathmatch is actually perfect right now. I'm gonna grab all this armor from my backpack and throw it out. I'm gonna make fusion armor and hope for pants. Oh my god, I actually got pants. This is perfect. Okay, we're pretty much set now. Let me make another G-head too. Got four G-heads, a regular head, and a gap. Well, that couldn't have went like any better right there. I got those three kills and I got fusion pants. So There's still four other people left, so I can still hit my uh, 10 kill mark if I get lucky, but... I see somebody running around over here. There's a full iron. He's getting chased by the staff guy. Oh, he got killed though. Okay, I'm gonna see if I can just fight this guy now. I have speed three. He's not gonna be able to run. I really hope I could have hit him in that lava right there. That would have been nice. He's like fully unenchanted diamond, so like... I have sharp four. I'll shred right through him. He's on eight. He has gaps. I think it's his last gap, actually. He really likes placing water. He really does not want to fight. Yeah, he's just gonna try and bow. He actually dropped his bow. That's uh, that's very unfortunate for him. He's just kind of panicking right now. He doesn't really know what to do. Get ahead. I should still be fine though. His sword actually does a decent amount of damage to me. This guy's definitely not bad either, but he just uh, doesn't have the gear right now. I get him a corner here. Okay, I got him in a corner. He's dead in here. I think my gear is just too good. He's trying to get out of it, but there's no escape, Wild Crystal. I'm sorry to tell you. It's over. It's over for you, buddy. I'm sorry, it had to happen. He had sharp for a drag. I was gonna say, that actually did a lot of damage to me. His Tarn Helm was almost broken, too. Alright, so let's make fusion armor here and see if uh, I can get a helmet. Oh my god, it actually happened. I have Prop 4, Prop 4, Prop 4, and Hermes Boots. And I can make another G head, so I have four. This is, uh, it's ridiculously OP, actually. <laughs> okay, the one guy is taking damage. He's dying to the border, dude, no! Oh, no, I'm not gonna be able to find him. He's gonna die to the border. I'm not gonna be able to get 10 kills now. That's so unfortunate, dude. wonder where he's gonna die at. He died over that way. Okay. I think I also took damage. Oh, it's, it's, it's this guy. It's upside down fruit berries for my streams. Well, he's, he's naked. Look, he's also got the fruit berries cape. He's also upside down. That's pretty funny. Right, door. It's your time. Nine kill win. I take those. I was pretty stacked. Full prop four, except for my uh, Hermes boots. Sharp four drag. This strat, like I said, probably my favorite strat to do on the server. Oh, hey, level 150 too. That's cool. I love doing that strat. And I'm glad it worked out that game. Anyways, if you guys enjoyed that video, feel free to drop a like and uh, consider subscribing to the channel. If you guys enjoyed, of course. Um, and if you guys want to watch another one of my videos, I have one for you in the top right. I hope you guys have a great day, and uh, I'll see you later.